Roland. Yep. I'm Preston Platt. I am the founder and CTO of Rock Paper Reality. <laughs> Telling your story in an immersive way is really important right now because we're getting more connected in this space. We're closing the bounds of what is possible as far as just having to be in person. I'd describe Rock Paper Reality as an immersive storytelling studio. We mostly innovate and bring brands into this space. We have clients ranging from Netflix, Sony, Qualcomm, Lenovo, Adobe, Intel, Microsoft. In the case of Ben & Jerry's, we get presented with this idea of doing an immersive ice cream experience. Now, uh, nobody's defined how ice cream should be displayed and to be tasty. We need to embrace everything that every client brings us and become somebody that's passionate about it to explain it and to bring it to life in this space is really the hard part, but I think using substance in general for the pipeline makes the processes super easy. The opportunity with the Padres experience was, this has got to be a futuristic thing, sitting in the Hall of Fame. We're thinking of using this kind of 3D look and feel. We definitely keep it. To start all that process, we start to mock things up in Figma. We get some concept images in there. We try to get some inspiration. Then we've got a great team that does work in Illustrator and Photoshop. So they start to figure out how these things work. Ultimately, everything that you build has got to be this organic thing that forms and functions like it should work, even though there's no world where it would. And then it presents the problem of how do you then texture this thing to look the way it should. Substance Designer ends up being a great place where we can procedurally generate a bunch of different materials. And then we go into Painter. I love the little scratches on the yellow uh, hydraulic press thingy. Yeah. At that point, we just add all those procedural effects to this. It really weathers it nicely. It makes it feel like it sits in the world. And then from there, straighten the stager so we can make sure we get client approval. An old workflow we used to use, we would go down the process of rendering these things out, putting them into AR, and then that would be a week of work. And then that's just to get client buy-off. And if they didn't like what they saw, it was kind of back to square one, where we had to restart over that whole entire process. And also, Substance works great with those traditional tools like Maya, Unity. There are tons of different input methods and plugins that work with them so that jumping into Substance is actually an easy process. Here's actually in Substance. I think at the end of the day, the magic of 3D is how do I bring something to life? And the whole Substance Designer Suite makes it a lot faster. I wish I had that when I was younger, right? Like, God, the pain we went through back in the day. <laughs>